All right, uh, welcome to Island Life Live. That's Melia part of Realina Girls right here. Aloha. David D in the place to be. And what is the scoops of kids nowadays? Now, I don't want to sound like a curmudgeon, you know, an old grumpy man. Uncle? <laughs> but it's not like it was back in our day, right? It's, it's a little bit different. Well, yeah. I mean, I think there's a, a lot more respect, I think, that we had for our kupuna and our elders. And mm -hmm. sometimes when you see those kids lipping off at their parents at the mall, you want to just step in there and, yeah, but. Yeah. I saw something like that at Costco the other day. We were just talking about Costco, but I was kind of like just waiting patiently. This guy was blocking the aisle. He was with his, his uh, keiki, and I was just waiting. I never said nothing, and then he saw me. He was like, move, and the, the kid told him, you move. Like, wow. <laughs> wow. Imagine if that happened to us when we, were, when we said wow. that when we was growing up. Catch wow. Well, well, I think one mom unlocked the secret to improving the behavior of her children. She started playing old school 90s shows for Not. her kids. Yeah, like Roly Poly Oli. Barry, we're right here, Roly Poly Oli. Do you guys remember this? I do. You do? Okay. Um, the uh, Bear in the Big Blue House, uh, Clifford, the Big Red Dog. The oh Magic School Bus and Arthur. Magic School Bus. Wow. This is, I mean, this is like you know after what? I our think, age. I think that would work. Yeah, because you know what kept me calm in my, when I was Kolohe was Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood. Oh, <laughs> yes. <laughs> it did an electric company. Yeah, see, that's, that's see, our days. See, it does work. Well, why does she think that it's these shows that are working and not the ones that are on TV now? Because well, the ones nowadays is junk. Yeah, it's, it's a little bit <laughs> it's junk. junk. Nicely put. Well, ask Louie, because, you know, she has kids that age now <laughs> yeah. watching watching the nowadays kind. But a couple of things she noticed. First of all, positive change in their behavior. Mm -hmm. She noticed a positive impact on the uh, toddler's sleep wow. pattern. Wow. Oh. Uh, because the old, the, the nowadays shows, the kids didn't want to turn off the TV. They just oh. wanted to watch. This one was yeah. like kind of mellowed them out a little bit. And uh, she noticed that older shows foster creativity and imagination. That's what it does. Yep. Like Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood. Yeah, yeah. In fact, Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood, the whole, the whole show was imagination. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh -huh. with the, the train and all of yeah. that stuff. But of course, yeah. we also like the Flintstones. No? That's our day, Scooby-Doo. What, what, what kind of what imagination yeah. was that? <laughs> Scooby-Doo, they're a little yeah, bit sketchy. That was, like, that was the hippie days, I think. But yeah, so if, if you're having like, you know, some issues with your kiki, and I know you are Le, Leui. Yeah? Her kiki are beautiful. They're perfect. Yeah. I'm still trying to figure it out, you know, after the fourth one. <laughs> <laughs> so put on the old 90s, uh, yeah. the old school 90s shows, and your kid's going to be my cutie. All right. Uh,